Good evening, beloveds. And I am here early, just a few minutes early. And I want to introduce myself and give those who would like to join with the magic of life the opportunity to jump on and join me through this exclusive meditation. So firstly, I would like to just point out that you can hear some music right now. And that music is about to cease. And that music is going to be joining us when the official meditation begins. So allow me to introduce myself to you. So my name is Terry Messenger and I am a clinical hypnotherapist and an alchemist. So an alchemist in the way that I love to revolutionize people's lives. And I'm probably more in my glory in reality when I go into this mode that you can probably hear my voice. It's an embodiment mode. It is a feminine mode. And sometimes you'll see me on my live streams and I'll be in a masculine mode. And I would like to just create a little bit of education about what I will be going through tonight in the way of sexual healing and also synchronizing masculine and feminine energy. Now, firstly, this is definitely appointed to both male and female. It's not just generated to the women. However, it's also generated for the men because it's true that we have sexual wounds throughout our lives, even if it wasn't in our own time, whether it was in past times or generations before that. And it's true that we have also become embodied with other people where we may have soul ties that are still connected. And those soul ties, when two people, man and woman, come together, they are bonded with this soul tie. And this can have repercussions because this is an energy field that we are then collecting and then collecting all of the energy fields that go beyond and with their partners and so forth and so on. So when I talk about sexual healing in the masculine and feminine energy, I'm not talking about the physical body only. That is not what this is pointed at. I'm going to do some healing in that sense so that we can remove implants, soul ties. However, what's important is that we're going to refine ourselves. We're going to come into a synchronized dance with both masculine and feminine energy. So I would like you to know that I will be sharing my screen and I will be allowing you to be able to enjoy the scene of a candle. And I would like you to find yourself somewhere comfortable where you will be uninterrupted for the next 30 minutes. So as you find this space, please also know that because there is hypnotic content in this, that it is best for you to be in a nice, quiet place. In other words, please do not drive or do anything that requires your concentration. Meditation is really in that embodiment of the presence. It's that divine, magical place that you can move into and you can feel such a divine presence that everything else disappears. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to share my screen with you and I'm going to begin the music. And I would like you to begin by just focusing on your breath. And as you focus on your breath, just allow yourself, your breath, to be deep, Allow your breath to also come from the region of your stomach. 
And as you feel the breath from that region deeply, peacefully, and so gratifyingly, I want to go on a magical journey with you and not just about the physical sexual essence like the animal kingdom. This is also a divine and most importantly, a divine spiritual element that is so attached to everything. Even before you were old enough to really understand your own sexuality, there was a life force born within you. And so as we do the dance between both masculine and feminine energy, I want you to now just sense the presence of your feet and I'd like you to place them on the ground and feel a sense that the ground is really grounding you in. And I'd like you to set an intention because what if I tell you that this is going to be part of a bigger program? This is going to be a prerequisite to your major success. This sexual healing and the divine dance of both feminine and masculine is going to allow you to go through the transmutation of channeling that sexual energy and directing it and knowing when to direct it. So I would like you to close your eyes and set an intention of the deep profound success through your God-given gift that you would truly love to embody a passion, a flame. And if the world was your oyster and you could wipe the slate clean and begin again, what traits would you develop? What would the balance of your life look like? What would it be like for you to be synchronised and grounded deeply into your most successful God-given calling? My calling, beloveds, is to heal, alchemize and transmute trauma trauma that can come from so many things and usually masculine and feminine energy plays a big vital role so this is going to be so powerful to heal those wounds and in a previous meditation we healed the wounds of relationships we alchemized and we became luminous. And now this is about healing the sexual energy, removing and releasing the implants and any soul ties that are attached to you that are operating as karmic forces, any patterns that are repeating on you any people that you have attracted into your life that you know have been energetically so downcast and you are now going to release and let go. You are now going to be able to move up and vibrate at such a high frequency that you are going to call in the most highest angels and guides. And to begin, I want to take you through this beautiful journey of sexual healing so that all wounds and your physical body will be replenished so that your blueprint will be healed of all impurities 
This will address all the soul ties of the past whom you shared a sacred space with. However, those people are no longer relevant and that energy now you are ready to release and let go. And if you are ready to do this, and if you are ready to be so free of any past wounds, including your own life childhood wounds, whether through shame, whether through sexual experience, whether you were humiliated, whether you were deprived of your liberty, any of those sexual wounds in your life and the past ancestral lineage are going to be healed when you say this prayer. I want you now to just open up your hands in this position and I want you to decree, decree to dissolve, clear and release and if you agree to dissolve, clear and release all those wounds from the past, then you shall certainly have this now to be done. So how wonderful it is for you to take in breath with your eyes closed down shut now. With your eyes closed down shut, I want you to breathe in through your nose, breathe in. And now breathe out. And I want you to know that you are going to bring in and call in the Earth Mother Mary. And as you do so, I want you to shed your physical body right now and rise up out of it so you can heal. Rise all the way up so you can leave your physical being for now and your physical being will be so replenished and renewed and regenerated that you will have so much divine, divine renewed, healed sovereignty. And now as we call on the most beautiful feminine Egyptian goddesses and the most strongest masculine males, we call on King David. We call on these as the most highest angels and all the angels that are looking over the priests, the priestesses, the kings, the queens, and all of the magnificent leaders on the planet that have favour of these special guides. I call on them now. And I ask you to deep breathe in through your nose and imagine yourself rising up and breathe out. And as you rise higher and higher, I want you to imagine that you are moving into an atmosphere where you are now looking across the universe. You are looking across the universe and now breathe in a new energy of Mother Mary. Breathe in again. And as you hold that breath, take in the divine, sovereign, nurturing energy and the being and exhale out and allow that exhalation to move into your physical body as you rise. <sighs> now I ask you to rise higher and higher until day becomes night, night becomes day and you're moving in through a timeless space. And now we call on the strength and the divine wisdom of King David. Breathe in and hold. And now breathe out. And 
imagine that you have the wisdom of the king the energy surrounding you as you rise higher and higher so you have the kings the queens and the support of all the highest angels surrounding you as you deep breathe in a timeless space and as we call in all these divine guides I want you to notice that you are now swimming in space you are connecting with the stars you sense the space all around you as if there is space even in your physical form you would sense the space between your eyes you would sense the space in your physical being between your shoulders and every part is space and you are now moving into one with the Venus planet and the stars are carrying you with the angels of the nurturing loving mother Mary and the strong wise King David and all the Egyptian queens and wise kings of ancient times are now floating you through space of time energetically moving you through time as if you are rewinding all of time backwards and time of all the impurity all of the soul ties that you had with people that you want to release and let go of any humiliation shame any sexual depriving of your own liberty is now going backwards rewinding and now as you go right back you're like a child and I want you to open your eyes and look upward as if you are in awe of the universe. And as you are healing all your old wounds and all the soul ties, I want you to imagine that you're looking down and you're pulling the attachments out from your body as if you are up so high and releasing soul ties detaching now looking up to the heavens again and I want you to remove all soul attachments from your mind in that masculine energy of thought process just remove all the thoughts the hurts and the wounds from your mind and now I want you to look straight ahead and hold your gaze and I want you to remove all soul ties from your gut as if you are intuitively removing all implants. And now I want you to look sharp to the left as if you are looking out to a star and I want you to remove all soul ties from this side and now look to the right and remove from the right and now like an innocent child I want you to look around and I want you to make your eyes big like a circle as if you are in awe of looking at all the stars and yet you are removing all wounds all all those energetic ties you are now removing and then move your eyes around in a circle in the other direction like a child playing and I want you to move your body as if you are swimming in space and as you release all implants as you remove you are now rewinding back through the years and the generations going right back to the beginning of time this is your majestic castle 
where everything is in a divine sense of perfection, where masculine and feminine energy meet one another and they have this divine dance. And yet as you look, you know that before you go into that castle, into that palace and embrace this vibrant, majestic temple that opens up to your success. You move your eyes looking around, you move your head and your eyes make big circles as you get rid of the last and you let go of all the humiliation and all the shame and the shame of your ancestors and anything that has burnt you or anybody else. You release it and let it go and you look the other side. You look around, your eyes are now moving left to right, up and down, and you are now letting go and releasing and becoming freer and freer. And now I want you to go through an alchemizing sunlight where you are now moving through a vibrant, bright circle of alchemy and you are filled with light you are breathing you can see your palace and your temple and this resembles the new empire that you're about to build and the solid ground that it is built upon is all the wounds and all the hurts and pains that you have been able to learn from and hold your wisdom now. And now as you become alchemized through the sun, I want you to decree by your own intention and free will, I decree to release and let go of all bondages, all negative beliefs, all soul ties of past generations, all corrupt sexual energy, all humiliation, shame that has been imparted on my own and any other past generations. And I set myself free to come into an alchemy so I may have the dance of feminine and masculine so I may have the ability to know how to channel into my success and now just look around one more time and make sure you cannot sense any wounds and if there are any wounds or hurts just look around with your eyes with a big circle until those wounds are healed as if every star that you're looking at as you're moving your eyes around looking up and down and sideways is healing you healing and alchemizing and now you're dropping down through the sun dropping down into your temple and as you drop down you have arrived at the top of a staircase and at the bottom of the staircase, you see a vision of you. And it's a vision of you where every step down was a step into your power. Every step down was a step into your divine energy. Every step down takes you deeper and deeper and deeper. And your creative success is going to be channeled, channeled. And I'm going to invite you to channel, 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 channel your energy. I'm going to invite you to build your majestic empire. I'm going to invite you now to allow yourself to be so incredibly healed that this gift that you have, is now going to give you the divine balance of feminine and masculine as you are healed in his stripes, as you are given the nurturing goddess magnetic mother nature of the feminine mother Mary 
and the masculine, strong, wise energy of the greatest kings. And now, as you look and you see yourself, what do you see? Who have you become? What did you do? Your life has been rebirthed. That's right, renewed. And just those 10 steps, eight steps, were just enough for you to find your voice, to release old rituals and habits, to now reinstate new habits that match your aligned self. And as you cellularly repair every element of your body, isn't it divine? That eight steps has taken you into the glory of being the ultimate you. And as you float down and you embrace just for a moment the energy of yourself, just feeling and touching and experiencing this divine crystal, masculine, feminine energy that gives you the ability to utilize that pure sexual energy as your life force and notice how that life force is now <sighs> moving through your timeline. And now it's time for you to connect with your present self so you can come back with this crystal clear clarity so you can understand and know exactly what you need to do now to build your empire. Eight steps, that's all it takes. And I'm going to count you up. One, two, becoming more radiant. Three, becoming healed. Four, five, six, energetic. Seven, crystal clear. Eight, nine, and just like magic, 10. And welcome back, welcome back. And I trust that you have enjoyed this sequence. I trust that this has really given you uh, invaluable healing over your life. And I'm gonna invite you now to build the eight cornerstones of your life now notice I'm moving from feminine energy into masculine and these wonderful, wonderful eight steps that you're going to take are going to literally rebuild your life. So we went through a meditation last week where we healed the wounds of relationships and this week we have done something spectacular where we have really it released those implants and completely dissolve the soul ties that you agreed to. And I'm going to invite you to come to the launch to see if this is going to be what you want. And I'm going to take you through the eight steps and it's going to be done over eight days and it's going to happen very quickly. It may take 30 minutes a day. It may take an hour. Sometimes it'll be 30 minutes. Sometimes it'll be an hour. And when it happens, it'll be so fast. We'll be covering your power, your voice, your God-given gift, your activation of courage. And as you come to just hear these words i wonder if you can just feel inside your body right now and just ask yourself the question will this be good and i want to say that in this group you are being invited first because i only want to hold a container for a certain amount of people so please let me know if you would like to be part of this now every single module 
is worth over $450 because it's healing those parts of your life. But it's not just healing, like I've gone through a healing with you tonight. It's rebuilding, rebirthing, reinventing. And that is so powerful. So each module is worth $450. And we, Dr. Ian and myself, are actually releasing it to a group of people for a one-time paid in full price of $97. So if you want to be in that, please drop it down in the comments or send me a private message. It doesn't matter whether you can't be on live, you will have the material for life. This is going to be the most amazing and greatest investment that you can possibly make for your life and what better time to reinvent yourself you guys than right now so my name's terry messenger please let me know in the comments say i'm in or perhaps private message me if you're really really private i honor you i understand that and i am giving you that privilege to do that so i'm going to ask you now to make sure you're crystal clear you're back you're healed, you're strong. And this video is going to be specifically held in a membership site. So I'm not sure whether it'll be here for 24 hours, maybe a little bit longer, maybe not that long. It depends on how long it takes to actually upgrade it and get it onto my membership site. So have an amazing evening. I'm going to go live now on my public page. So if you want to join me and give any testimonial of what you experienced, I would greatly appreciate it. So bye for now. See ya.